Okay, here's a good video that I have of an exercise that I'm actually uh, loving doing myself at the moment to help my sore shoulder, um, which I've had a bit of a rotator cuff tear in, in my right shoulder for some time. And um, to be honest, I've struggled with thoracic mobility nearly all my life, as long as I can remember. So it's, this is something that I've found has helped me quite a lot. So I'm going to show you how it works. Um, there's, there's two parts to this. So basically, you've got your hand behind your back, and then you try to rotate it around as far as you can. You can see I really struggle to get to that, that end range on that last, when it comes right up. So I've got to open right up. And if I just pause this for a second, what, what you really need to do to get the most out of it is this arm that's on the floor here. You really need to push quite hard into the floor to get the, the, the shoulder to be perfectly stable. Because um, what I'm wanting is this arm that's sort of on that angle. I'm really wanting that arm to come right around to there. Which would the only way I can do that is with the mobility of the shot of the thoracic spine. And if I enhance the stability of the shoulder on the floor, it makes it a lot easier. All right. So if I keep going, because there's another part to this, so um, you'll see I usually do about three or four on each side before switching sides. Um, and make sure you turn your head around. You see, I really struggle to get my head. I had a lot of a very stiff neck on that right side. Now, this is the second part to it. This one is even. This one sort of hurts me to be honest. So, um, my shoulder's not happy being there at all. And most pop people find this is the hardest one to do. Uh, they really find. And uh, you again, you'll see where I get stuck. I just don't quite get that end range uh, that I'm really looking for. And then I switch sides. Um, Again, start with behind the back, and you'll see I move a lot more freely on this side. Again, I have to push hard with my right arm into the floor, um, which, you know, to be honest, my right arm's not happy with that, and my head comes around that just that little bit better on the side. Um, and a great drill to really encourage that that area around around here to get it twisting and turning. So, because a lot of people, it just it just gets locked down, um, and it doesn't really do the work that it should do, hence they get shoulder neck pain. Alright, so that's a good drill. Um, I'll stay tuned and I'll show you another one.